Mason Mount rejects latest contract offer. Chelsea midfielder Mason Mount has reportedly rejected the latest contract extension offered to him. There is still plenty of time for an agreement to be reached but Mason Mount's contract is starting to become a bit of a worry for Chelsea. Negotiations have been ongoing for weeks and reports have emerged that he rejected the latest proposal just before the World Cup. Matt Hughes of the Daily Mail broke this news on Friday following the conclusion of England's 0-0 draw with the USA. Hughes claims this proposal would have upped the Englishman's wages to over £200,000 a week, which is evidently not enough. Negotiations have been paused for the World Cup and a swift agreement is unlikely once the two sides re-enter discussions, with both parties being a long way apart. Mount is currently one of the lowest paid players in the squad and he is looking to be on similar figures to summer arrival Raheem Sterling, thought to be on around £300,000 a week. Chelsea's proposals have been considerably lower than the 23-year-old's demands, leading to this concerning impasse in talks. This is something to keep an eye on as Mount's contract enters its final 18 months. Chelsea join race for Atletico Madrid's Joao Felix. Chelsea have joined the race to sign Atletico Madrid forward Joao Felix. Joao Felix has failed to develop into the player the world felt he could since joining Atletico Madrid from Benfica, but that may not be all the Portuguese forward's fault. Diego Simeon and Atletico employ a style of football that doesn't exactly promote forwards like Felix, and he could certainly benefit from a move away, and Chelsea may be the team that give him that chance. Felix is set to leave Atletico, and Chelsea have reportedly thrown their name in the hat. According to Spanish publication Marca, Chelsea have joined the race to sign Atletico Madrid forward Joao Felix, and could try and bring the Portuguese forward to Stamford Bridge in the coming months. The report suggests that Felix has told the Spanish club he wants to leave, and Chelsea may have already been in contact with the agent of the player in regards to a move. The Portuguese forward scored for his country against Ghana in a 3-2 win the other night, and Graham Potter may have been watching on at a player that could potentially become a blue in the coming months. Chelsea are monitoring a forward player, and if Rafael Leao cannot be signed then Joao Felix could certainly become an option. Manchester United are also interested, so Chelsea will need to be very quick if they are to sign Joao Felix. Chelsea eye Brighton goalkeeper Robert Sanchez. Chelsea are targeting Robert Sanchez to replace Edouard Mendy. Chelsea are anticipating the departure of goalkeeper Edouard Mendy, and have already begun to identify replacements in the event it does happen. Robert Sanchez is one of those. Graham Potter has a brilliant relationship with the Brighton goalkeeper, who is currently at the World Cup with Spain, but is yet to make an appearance. Chelsea are targeting Robert Sanchez, and he could be the ideal goalkeeper to fit into what Potter wants to do at his new club. According to Simon Phillips, Chelsea have Brighton goalkeeper Robert Sanchez as a main target for the goalkeeper spot. Sanchez is the main target, and he may be the one the club move for to replace Mendy in the Chelsea net. Jordan Pickford was another player that was looked at it, but at this moment in time Sanchez is the number one target for Chelsea. Graham Potter wants a goalkeeper more comfortable with the ball at his feet to build up play from the back as he did with his Brighton side. Sanchez was instrumental in that success. The Spanish goalkeeper is likely to be open to the move to a bigger club, as it would surely stake his claim to start in the Spain team in the future. One to keep an eye on for Chelsea, as they definitely look to strengthen the goalkeeper spot over the coming months. Chelsea interested in Ecuador defender Piero Hincapi. Chelsea are looking to bolster their defensive options, and they could look to a player who is performing well in the World Cup so far. Piero Hincapi has been part of an Ecuador defence that has conceded one goal in 180 minutes of football so far, and Chelsea are eyeing the defender as a possible option. Hincapi plays for Bayer Leverkusen, and may be interested in a move to a bigger club like Chelsea. According to Tom Hopkinson of the Mirror, Chelsea have interest in Ecuador defender Piero Hincapi and are scouting the player's progress at the World Cup. Hincapi has impressed so far, in an Ecuador side who are causing some waves in the World Cup so far. The Ecuador side play in a back three, which may be one of the reasons Chelsea are interested in the player. He could fit perfectly into Graham Potter's system. Hincapi signed for Bayer Leverkusen from Argentine side club Atletico Talas at the start of the 21-22 season and has scored three goals did the club since then. Chelsea are monitoring a large number of centre-backs as they look to narrow down the list to find the right ones, and a few more impressive performances from Hincapi could really do him good. Nothing is imminent as of yet, 
but they are scouting the player, and his performances at the World Cup may go a long way towards the final decision Chelsea make. Arsenal and Manchester United keen on Chelsea flop Christian Pulisic following World Cup heroics. Arsenal, Manchester United and Newcastle are set to battle it out for the signing of Chelsea outcast Christian Pulisic, according to reports. Pulisic moved to Stamford Bridge from Borussia Dortmund in 2019 for £58 million but has failed to establish himself in the Blues' first team, with neither Frank Lampard, Thomas Tuchel, or Graham Potter fancying the winger. The 24-year-old has shown moments of class over the past few seasons and to date has 47 goal contributions in 133 appearances, but it is understood that he has grown frustrated with his role in Chelsea. And with Potter in the process of reshaping his squad to his liking, it is expected that Chelsea will cash in on Pulisic very soon, especially since the American international only has 18 months left on his contract. As for where he could move to, it seems he'll be staying in the Premier League with the Daily Mail reporting that Arsenal, United and Newcastle are keen on securing Pulisic's services when the transfer window reopens in January. While his contract is running down, Pulisic will not come cheap, with Chelsea looking for £35 million for the player, whose value will have increased somewhat following impressive performances at the Qatar World Cup. Pulisic was particularly eye-catching in the USA's goalless draw with England on Friday, where he was awarded the Man of the Match award and came closest to breaking the deadlock when he hit the crossbar in the first half. The Red Devils and the Magpies inquired about his availability back in August and both still hold an interest, the former especially after the departure of Cristiano Ronaldo. However, it does not appear as if Pulisic is Eric Ten Hag's first choice, with United still pursuing PSV forward Cody Gakpo who has also been on their radar since the summer. The 23-year-old is enjoying a superb season and has also been making headlines in Qatar, with two goals in two games for the Netherlands. The Gunners meanwhile are after a new winger as they look to maintain their lead at the top of the table, though Mikel Arteta's focus is on signing Shakhtar star Mihailo Mudrik.